I am shattering expectations. I'm using adversity to my advantage. I am not letting blindness limit me. I'm pioneering possibilities. We are most unlikely teams of students. Embarking on extraordinary journeys. We are all leading the way. Leading the Way is a, is a really exciting project begun by Global Explorers to take uh, blind teenagers and sighted teenagers to bring them together into one team and have them work together. They go to the Andes, they go to the Grand Canyon, they go to the rainforest, but really the sky's the limit. Just because you're disabled, it doesn't mean that you don't have the same dreams, the same sense of adventure, the same spark as anyone else. It is so ridiculous to limit people based on their vision. Right in front of that one. Right there, yeah. And it's very irritating when people impose limitations on you. When you're blind especially, you're going to have to learn to work with sighted people. And it's not about functioning with other blind people. It's about living in a sighted world. So, so to bring blind and sighted kids together, helping each other and each of them asserting a sense of leadership. Okay. I mean, I think that's, that's very important. I had no clue how to act around blind people, <laughs> to be blatantly honest. <laughs> but when I got there and got to know everyone, I realized everyone on this trip is just a bunch of normal kids wanting to go explore the world. And I realized that Hey, I fit right in. <laughs> we definitely have more in common than what divides us. I soon realized that the conference calls, the homework, the actual training, and the actual trip itself took a lot of self-motivation, a lot of patience, and a lot of commitment. On these trips, not only do you get the educational, the leadership aspect, but you also have a big service piece. The village leaders uh, asked us to do, a, do them a community service favor, and um, they decided that uh, we should paint their school. The service portion of these trips really adds a lot. It's actually interacting with those people who are living that life that textbooks tell you. experience that I won't forget and hopefully I'll keep in, in my life for as long as I live and I hope that other kids of my age can have an opportunity to do what I did. When I came back it's like okay I've done this what can I do next to motivate myself as a blind person and thereby by my experiences motivate others around me. These trips have impacted my life a huge amount. I, I don't go a day without thinking about something that happened on the trip. I'm standing on the highest yeah. point of our trip on top of a cairn on top of a pass which is about top of a mountain. <laughs> on top of a mountain which is about 15,100 feet in elevation and it's quite cool. I now have a new desire to give back to my community. I now believe I can overcome any obstacle. I now know there are no limits to what I can do. I now respect all people, no matter their differences. I now understand the power of a determined spirit. The time is now. How will you lead the way? <laughs>